So I've owned the Crux for a month now, and I want to share my approach to this fascinating fidget toy. Starting with what I think everyone should learn, and that's sliding the top plate. What I'm doing is essentially pinching the bottom tip of the second plate while my thumb pushes forward. Doing this will unlock the rocker function. Now, slide the second plate up one notch, and now you'll have a clicker. I press the thumb down fully, and now you've achieved two clicks in one. Let's reset, and this time, push the top plate fully past the second. Right away, we'll have the hinge available my go-to for mindless fidgeting. Move the top plate just past the catch, let go and let it come back to you. Bonus points for those who land flush on the second plate. The shuffle. This ultra satisfying move is easy to do. If you're having trouble, try loosening your grip and let the thumb drive down fully. The more broken in your crux is, the easier they'll be. Let's play a game. We all know the hinge move by now, but let's bring it back, skipping one notch and then two notches. It's harder than you think. What I love about this is that it puts you right in position into another maneuver. Two body mode. This is my favorite shuffle. Lastly, one move I've learned from Mike, it's the spin shuffle. I just want to say big props to Mike and Taylor for creating something that feels like it belongs in my hands from day one. This is truly function meets form. Thank you for watching and please consider subscribing if you'd like to see more.